Good evening, everyone. It's Thursday night, and I am just getting around to making a video. I'm telling you, I'm totally exhausted. <sighs> My son got married yesterday. My firstborn. My only son. He married this adorable darling girl, and we're just so happy. But he had rented a cabin. He wanted to have a real rustic wedding, and so we went there. It's, it's real close to where I live, so I didn't have to travel, but uh, it was hot, and there was so much just running around to do, and I'm not used to that. Setting up the tables and the, you know, it was just, the it family did it. Me and my daughters did all. He had the supper catered, but all of the hors d'oeuvres and the tables and every decorations. We did all that while the bride-to-be was gone to get her hair done. But it was fun, and I enjoyed it, but I was so tired. And today, the calves of my legs were just absolutely killing me. But I wanted to participate in Theme Thursday. But I did get one baby done. I got little Maisie, my Laura. And she's ready for a picnic. Look at her beehive, guys. Watch the bee. He's, going, he's been out of the beehive and you pull it and he slides back up in the beehive. Isn't that adorable? This is my granddaughter's when she was a baby. She's just 18 months old, but I don't think she liked it. And my daughter gave it to me. Watch him. He's going up in the beehive. And it's playing the music. He's going slowly. See his head starting to peep out. There he is. And he's a happy bee. Look at that smile. I don't know where she got it from. Kay's kids. But that's very cute. I don't have anywhere to hang it. I hang it off the crib and it's so cute though. But anyway, I recuperated a little bit today. My daughter, my youngest daughter made the wedding cake so my kitchen was a total wreck. So I did clean my kitchen today. But look at Laura's dress. She's taking care of the tea party for the picnic. This beautiful little dress. I bought off of eBay and it was a size 5T and I took it apart and made it smaller. See how I've cut this long part off and reattached the hem and you can't really tell it. You can't tell it's been done like that. I did the best I could and I took out a bunch of the weight, the width in the sides and I put snaps in the back. They really could have been a little tighter. But I cut down the side, both sides and took a lot of that fabric out. And it fits her. It's too long. But I left it long so that the other babies could wear it. And she's got a pretty flower on her new passy. See there? And she's got another passy that matches it. It's her new passies. And it's got a butterfly and a flower. And they're pink and gold. I think they're so pretty. That's it for today, guys. That's all I can manage to do. Oh, and then right in the middle, right before the wedding started, my three-year-old grand started, son started throwing up. And he had his hemangioma taken off the side of his eye. He had surgery two days before the wedding, so he was not feeling good anyway. And his eye was huge, and he got sick. He's doing good today, my daughter said, but... Now I'm getting ready for us all to get the virus. But anyway, it's good to be alive. It's good to be happy, and I hope you're all happy and doing well. I'm sorry for coming on here and complaining. I just had to tell you my what happened yesterday and what I was doing and why I've been so late getting on here. I hope you're all doing fine, though. I will be back, and I appreciate you watching. 
I mean, if you can, please subscribe. I need, I need subscribers, guys. I love you. I'll talk to you all later. Bye.